Hey guys, it's Sam at NetWave here with another tutorial helping you get the most out of your online business. Uh, today's tutorial, as I'll, like all of our others, can be found on our website at www.netwavesolutions.com. Um, today's tutorial, we're going to go over finding a domain name and setting up hosting for your new website. Uh, so we're going to start here at netwavehost.com and we're going to search for a domain domain name go into register domains this is where you'll key in whatever domain you are looking for it'll tell you what's available um, for instance if we go into netwave solutions dot com and we click on the search come back and tell us that that website is in use it's already taken but it's nice that here because it gives you the choices the US info the ones that are available so we're going to get, try another one this is for a client of ours and I know that she wants pattycakes.net so we're going to select that do a search and this one tells it it is available at this point, we could go in and select other ones if you want the US, the info, the org. Uh, some people think that's a good idea to go ahead and capture those. Uh, for this example in this tutorial today, we're just going to register this one domain. Um, it also gives you lots of other choices, variations that you can go with. Uh, we're going to go ahead and click continue. And this will be the screen where if you don't have a NetWave host account yet, you can go ahead and fill in your name, email address, all this information, and click continue. We actually have an account and a password for this client. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and click on the secure login. And at this point, we have registration options. We're going to select one year. You can select different years here. The, the longer the year term that you select uh, can have an impact on your SEO. Um, Google has said that the longer you hold a domain, it just shows that you're you know, more serious about being in business. Um, this is kind of an experimental site, we're just, so we're just going to select one year. Um, all the, we're going to take all the defaults here, and we are going to customize my order. You have two choices here. If you're just going for the domain, you can click here and say, no thanks, I'm ready to check out. We need to actually add hosting. So we're going to click Customize My Order and click Continue. Next screen, we're going to have lots of options. They're going to try and sell you everything under the moon for your domain. Um, however, the main thing we're interested in is the hosting plan. We are going to select the Economy Hosting Plan. Uh, as again, again, I said this is kind of a test site. We don't want we don't want to go with the, the top the top of the line here. So we're just going to go with the um, Economy hosting, you have to select for a minimum of two months, and then it goes month to month after that. You can select uh, 12 months or 24 or 36. You have those options. Um, I always choose Linux. Um, depending on what you're going to do, you may need Windows or Linux, depending on the, if you're going to use a database, that kind of thing. Uh, for right now, we're just going to select not Linux, the very basic uh, hosting plan. Uh, lots of choices here. Um, you can add any of these things to your hosting package at this time. You can also, of course, always going to have plenty of chances to go back and add these things later. Um, an online file, photo file, traffic facts. Uh, I've used a lot of these services. I'll be happy to answer any questions on those if you want to shoot me an email at sam at netwavesolutions.com. be happy to go over any of those options with you. Uh, shopping cart options, secure certificates, etc. Uh, we're just going to go with the basic hosting. Click continue. And we'll go on to the next page, and this is actually a review of our shopping cart. You'll see that we have the domain, pattycakes.net, at one year, and the price, and the hosting, two months at $8.98 per month. Okay, at this point, you also have some choices here. Again, they're trying to upsell you on some additional domains. Uh, we're not going to do any of that. Uh, looks like we're good. We're going to select our credit card. Uh, these are um, 
domain registration agreement and universal TOS. You'll need to read through those. Make sure you're okay with that. Of course, I have read through them. Check out now. And this is pretty basic. If you've shopped online, you know what to do here. Okay, so we've just pressed the uh, confirm button after keying in our credit card information and your uh, validation screen check, your verify code, and you're done. That's it. We now have a thank you. You can print out a receipt. Okay, so I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial today. Uh, we have a whole lot more tutorials on helping you get the most out of your online business. Visit us at www.netwavesolutions.com. That's N-E-T-W-A-V-E-S-O-L-U-T-I-O-N-S.com. My name is Sam. I'm Sam at NetWaveSolutions.com if you want to send me an email. Look forward to hearing from you. And until next time, thanks and have a great day.